a day in the life of a diva. Hello, I'm Sandra Radvanovsky. Have you ever wondered what the final days, hours, and minutes before the curtain rises on the Met stage are like for a diva? Well, you're about to find out. First up, I met with the two founders of the Sandra Rabinowski Instagram fan club. And now, I'm going to visit my dear friend, Marina Abramovich. Hello! How are you doing? Medea is such a difficult role. I'm on the stage like a snake. Like, I'm crawling around like a snake. I am bruised, as I showed you, like, everywhere. You know, I know when I'm giving 150%, it's all I have. Yeah. But you have to give everything you have. Before my vocal coaching and a visit to my osteopath, we have a quick trip to celebrate a colleague with a champagne toast. And now I'm going to my voice coach, Tony Minoli, to go work on my Carnegie Hall recital music. So we'll see you there. Right off the cord. I mean, I'm really... Do I want to take that breath? Where? It's up to you. That for sure, because yes. you don't know if he's dead. We need to work on well, that. Well, yeah. Okay. Maybe not today. Next, I'm off to visit the man who gets my body ready to unlock that inner stage snake. My osteopathic manual practitioner, Joel Egan. He's truly gotten me through these performances. Being a warrior princess on stage comes with a price. And this gentleman right here makes it all better. And now it's three hours to showtime. My lovely makeup artists begin to transform my face from Sandra to Medea. Don't you just love the super rocker chick dramatic eye makeup? And now, since I am not a dancer, one has to loosen up their 53 year old hips. But you know what, I should be used to this by now because every David McVicker show that I do, I am on the floor. If you want to move like a snake and do all these cobra things that I do, you have to be loose in your hips here. And finally, I get my wig on and then it's time for a quick fight warm up. There she is. Hey. Hey. Great, so the half speed. Great, should we go three quarter? It's going to be full speed, nice and sharp, everyone, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's always good. Yeah. And you wonder why I need to go to an osteopath. <laughs> okay. Oh, this way. Come on. Good job. Good job, everyone. And after all these preparations, it's now time to take the stage and become Medea. <laughs> 